That's me, Bliss. And that's Regis. He doesn't like to be on camera. And this is our story. A trail love story. We met in our masters. Regis was the stoic new lab mate who asked me to get coffee and showed me the local trails to run. I was wide-eyed and giddied about science and my growing love of the outdoors. The first email he ever sent me read, for all your outdoor adventures. Neither of us knowing how many of those we would have together. Quickly turned enemies, back to friends. A late night out with friends turned into Saturday morning pancakes, a trail run, and the rest was history. Regis took me running up and down my first mountain three weeks later, and I was hooked. On the trails and the boy who sat across from me, making me ramen noodles in the parking lot on a camp stove. As two aspiring PhD students, I couldn't help to ask him, is this silly? Is this even realistic and possible? Oh, Anne, I think we can take it all the way, he said back. And as a man of his word, I should have always known. time marked with mountains and trails and a certain certainty that comes when you live out of a car with someone for three weeks. The kind of love that makes you want to reroute your path so that they merge together. Six years later, we would elope in the same mountains. In all those years between, we grew together and worked towards our doctorates, perfectly independent and yet on the same team in every way. We broke up the long weeks in lab with long days on trail, coffee shops, and mountain getaways. Everything became sweeter and stronger and better along the way. The language of our love was simple. Science, coffee, mountain air, and the dirt under our feet. This was us, both at our best and always together.